Hi folks, this is a CFX tutorial, solid tutorial number one. Uh, in this uh, CFX tutorial, I'll be showing how to clip a solid, validate a solid, a repair a solid, and then you determine the volumes uh, after that. Uh, the menu you'll be using is um, under the solids. Then you go to validate, I use uh, solid rules. Uh, there's some others up here, you could triangulate, object edit, I'll show you as we go through. Okay, uh, that's the functions, um, solid validation, object trisolation, you got uh, solid validation, solid repair, solid, solid tools, clips above, uh, clip solids above DTM, and you got solid volume and curve. I'll show you as we go through. Okay, I'll get into it. I've got my folder here. Um, basically, I'm trying to do a refocus for June 14. Um, I'll just bring out um, as build for June. So I want to find out how much volume is left uh, from. So that's my as build for June um, this year. And then there's a design for this volume. Say I want to find out, say John A. So that's a solid. It's a solid design. Okay, I've got this. So this is a whole big um, solid that has been created as part of the design. So I'm gonna clip this uh, bottom bit off, and then find out how much I have on this uh, top one. So with a federal do, I'll start. So first, I'll go click. Um, Solid tools, I'll go clip solid above DTM. Um, just name the file A. Um, let's put a date on it sixteen zero five. One. I'll give a nine. I like that uh, red maroon car. So eight, <coughs> and apply that. So it's asked me to uh, select the 3DM trisolation. So I pick this one, and then he asks me again to select DTM trisolation, which is this one. It's gonna take a while. Uh, I didn't tell you about this, but basically the solid was created than previously. Uh, in tutorial 2, I'll show you how to create a basic solids from string files. Uh, but for this one, it's already been found. Okay, it basically has clipped the stuff off for me. I'll just uh, save it. i name the file again. A1606, sorry. First one was incorrect and then zero one. Apply that. Okay, I've got uh, some cuttings here that I'm not interested in, so I'll go click uh, this box select points here and I'll just basically delete that. It's gonna allow me to delete this. If you hear sound, just try it again. I don't know. Some, for some reason, it just doesn't want to delete the first time. Try it again. It's gone. Keep on going. Delete all of that. There's an easier way where you just save the crash license, which I might show you as well. Um, 
it just goes up very solid um, solid tools and you sorry uh, it's the trisolation it's the trisolation so I'll just it's not a correct way of doing it, but I just want to check what number this is. This is number eight. Object is eight. Trisolation is one. So I just want to save that. No, let's do that. Um, so eight and one, I'm interested in. So I'll go edit trisolation. I want to delete eight and then two because two to. Then, like that, it again, delete range, two to ten. A very wrong comment. No, it doesn't work. Forget that, we'll just do it manually. So I'll go back to this. Yeah, but there should be an easy way to get rid of this. It's got a long way. Okay, that's it. See that's all clean. To save that. Okay, and then I'll use my validation tool. Just, uh, it's asking me for a validation file. I'll just put val, and then I go apply. So it's just validating the thing. Uh, I'm checking to make sure there is no holes or closed open edges. previous versions uh, it's a nightmare you just take a lot of iterations before you come to this but uh, with this new version 6.5.1 it just does it in one hit uh, which is good um, even if it doesn't do validation in the first run you can go to solid repair and it automatically does a repair for you so don't know why it's taking that long Confused, maybe.
Oh, kind of crest. Sorry, we just have to restart again. <clears throat> Okay, get it going again, sorry. Go back to that file, turn this up a tutorial and tutorials from a student, there's one of my students out there. June focus. So I've got this here. Should have saved it in here. No, save it in there. Just delete this. I don't want to have duplicate copies in there, so. Okay, bring this back out again. Well, we crashed on the validation, so we'll try again. We'll try validation. Strike well. So it's and apply even to validate the whole stuff. Okay, it's got closed. There's got uh, one open edge. Um, so invalid. So I'll just. Um, uh, that's the CM, so you just go save that. We'll go to solids. We have to repair the solids. So solids repair it's just comes on the side. So you have to click on the sides and it comes on. Some files, there's some rubbish here that needs to go. Yeah. Okay, it's gone. Save that. Go solid. I'll validate that again. It must be that one that's causing the problem. So, here we go. Okay, everything is close, which is good. We've got some minor pieces there, but the big one is this big volume that you want. So that's it. Now you got your solid. And then you go solid. Tools, what is the volume? Report volume of solids. So I'll go volume. SD. So let's make them. Sixteen, sorry, fifteen, zero, six, zero, one. I want to save it as CC. Let's get rid of this. I want television range. So you give me from nineteen fifty to two thousand. And you give me at uh, 0 0.1 meter intervals. Apply. I'll show you why it's 1 meter. You can send in your spreadsheets. And I'll go apply. So there you have it, you got your volume now, so you can basically export your volume into a spreadsheet and then work on it. And thanks, that's um, Satak uh, Solids tutorial number one.